you have uh, you have moved a few times with your collection. Any tips? Uh, tips? Are they are the books going to storage or are they going to your new home that you're gonna put the books up? Okay. If they're going to your new home to put the books up, just label the boxes so you know where everything is and get the movers or your friends <laughs> or yourself to put the things in the right place. Okay, if they're going to storage, Nicholas, do this. Take a just a cloth, right? Put some rice and baking soda in it. And then close up the cloth with a with a ribbon or something. Just close it off so you have like a sack, right? And put one of those in every box. That way it'll suck up the moisture just in case the storage area is moist or you know they get flooding or just that just the air is moist, right? Because you obviously you know that you don't want moisture to hit the books because uh, moisture damage is a pain. Right, so put a rice and baking soda in a just a just like a cloth like this. Just put it in and then close it up. It doesn't even have to be this big. It's smaller than this. Just put it in each box. And I personally, uh, when I took all my books, I took a cardboard box. Books, uh, comics. I don't do that with, but books. I put a garbage bag in the box. And I put the comic or books in the box inside the garbage bag, and I put one of those uh, rice and baking soda uh, cloth balls inside the plastic bag with the books, and I close it up and close off the boxes. Uh, and I've had books in storage for a long time, and you know, as you know, we showed them with the videos, and they all came out okay. So that's what I would do personally. And man, yeah, sweet bro, appreciate that. I normally handle my own books, but with the job switch, movers are doing everything, so I have to leave specific instructions. Yeah, okay, cool.